yeah, of that crazily, weirdly patriotic act. Um, let's tell you something about Holland, because we're only hearing any stuff about America this week. Um, I've decided to be honest, I'm only going to tell you things I actually knew. Um, which is not a lot, because I quit history last year and because I did the bilingual stream, we only got like British history. So there's not really much I know. So, but what I do know a lot about is about the struggle against the water thing. 60% of the landmass of the Netherlands is underneath sea level. So we've always been trying to get the water out. Um, and it's essential because otherwise we couldn't fit all these 60 million people on this tiny little space of land. So what we had to do is make polders. We did this using the old famous windmills that we put on the side of a lake and would pump the water out into a second higher level and then we would use a couple of windmills to get the water out. We've actually grown so good at this that people from all over the world have asked us to come create their islands over there. Like in Dubai where they asked a Dutch man to make the Palm Island. We're also pretty good at just keeping the water out instead of actually getting the water out. And we're actually pretty good at building dikes and bridges. The most famous ones are of course Delta Works. I don't know what they're called in English, but in Dutch they're called Delta Works. And they are the big dikes in Sealand. Uh, because after the big flood in 1953, in which almost the whole of Sealand was flooded, they had to build huge, big, strong dikes to make sure the water would stay out um, for eternity, to make sure that it's not gonna get in. So we built these huge, awesome dike things. Um, they're pretty cool. I went there two weeks ago. Other than that, the Dutch have always been travelers. They've always been an explorer. They weren't as aggressive as some of the other uh, countries were, like Britain and France, because they like to just go to a country and kill it and then take all the stuff and get it back. We kind of killed it from the inside. We got Indonesia. Um, and what we did is basically employ people, employ Indonesian people to exploit their own people. So what we would do is um, employ people who would have to pay taxes and these people would have to get taxes from people as well. So the people at the very bottom would pay double or triple or even more taxes. Also, like John mentioned, we kind of founded New Amsterdam. New York. Um, yeah, we founded that. We called it New Amsterdam and then we traded it with the Brits for Suriname. Uh, we didn't, they didn't take it by force, as John said. We actually traded it for a country that looked, that was way bigger, that was um, way more fertile and that kind of thing. But imagine if we'd have kept New York. You probably will be speaking Dutch right now. Extreme screen in my eyes. <laughs>